Good afternoon, everyone. How are you doing? Ready for some data visualization? This is one of the most exciting things that I get to do while I'm here at AGU. Um, my name is Randy Pfizer, and I'm the CEO for AGU. So we're responsible for all of that you have been um, participating in over the past week. Uh, and we love this partnership that we have with NASA um, around the Michael Freelich Student Visualization Competition. Uh, this is our, we've been doing since 2016. Um, and since 2016, we've had 47 winners of the um, Michael Freelich Student Visualization Award. Uh, and the folks who do this in the seven grand prize winners, some of which you'll hear today, and seven runner-up winners, not only did they, um, are they undergraduate and graduate students, it also includes some first-time submitters and some people, so if you've submitted and haven't won, who applied for a second year and actually got their award on the second year. So if you haven't, um, if you have submitted in the past, um, think about doing that again. And if you have, some, if you haven't submitted, think about it because this is a great opportunity for exposure and a great opportunity to um, really demonstrate your work. And this is one of the most multidisciplinary um, pieces of work that we present here at AGU. Uh, so folks don't just come from the Earth and Space Sciences background, they come from all other areas of the difference. So congratulations to the winners um, for the creativity they have displayed. Uh, you'll get to meet all of them and they're going to go through their work. Uh, but with that, I'm going to turn it over over to Steve, who's going to bring up the winners. Uh, thank you, Randy. Yeah. Thank you. So uh, I'm going to say a few uh, remarks about the history of this program and NASA's involvement. Uh, I'm Steve Platnick. I'm an Earth scientist at the NASA Goddard Space Flight Center. That's in Maryland. And I've been involved in this since the beginning. An office I have at Goddard uh, manages the grant and the process where we uh, provide money to AGU to run this uh, competition. And so to do that, I work very closely with folks at headquarters that support this, and of course a great staff at AGU that we've been working with over the years, uh, as Randy said, since 2016. Um, the other thing I should say is I've been coming to AGU fall meetings since the early 90s. Now I know I'm dating myself, um, but it's been a long time that I've been coming here. And of course, when I came, NASA had exhibits uh, for many years. And so it's just a wonderful uh, thing to come back to here, to a fall meeting, to see NASA and AG working together for this student visualization competition. So uh, wonderful to be here. Um, before I introduce the winners uh, for today, I just want to say a few uh, remarks about Michael Freilich, who's the namesake for this competition. And Mike was the um, head of the Earth Science Division uh, for 12 years before he stepped down in uh, 2019 and before his uh, passing a year later. So Mike was a real strong advocate for uh, science communication in general and for students in particular and probably in part due to his academic uh, experience before he came to NASA. But Mike was involved in this since the beginning in 2016 and so it was quite fitting that AGU honored him by renaming this competition after his passing and for all the contributions he's made. Um, with that said, I just want to say how excited I am to uh, learn science. You know, science is never done until you explain to someone what you've learned and why it's important. So I'm really looking forward to uh, hearing from our winners today. Um, and let me just introduce them. And I think we're going to have a little, uh, some, you know, gift bag for them and some pictures. So, in the order that they'll be presenting. And by the way, there's four presentations today. We'll have another three tomorrow at the same time. So today we have Lauren Gold from Arizona State University. We have Austin Brenner from University of Michigan. And he brought his fan club with him, not too far away. Uh, Jessica Besnier from UVA, University of Virginia. And finally, June Kim from Northwestern University. And I believe we're going to have some photo ops here. So just indulge us for a moment. Oh, 
Okay, thanks everyone. We're going to get started with uh, Lauren.